guys welcome back to our youtube channel marina's helpline today we are here with a new video if you have not subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel for the latest updates and new videos i hope that my videos will be helpful to you in your class for preparation so let's start guys please press the bell icon to subscribe to my channel mariners helpline you can also comment in comment section on the topics in which you would like me to make the videos so please comment and i will try to cover the topics so let's start guys today we are here on the topics latest amendments on marpol convention guys this questions is definitely asked by the surveyors that what are the latest amendments on marpol so we'll try to cover some latest amendments of marpol so we'll start with the annex 1 so guys annex 1 is for regulation for prevention of pollution by, by oil then they have come up with a new electronic orb 1 and orb 2 available from 1st october 2020 Next we will go for annex 4 that is regulation for prevention of pollution by sewage from ships so here yeah, there is a restriction on discharge of untreated sewage from passenger vessel carrying 12 passenger or more in the baltic sea Now next is annex 5 that is regulation for prevention of pollution by garbage from ships here the new categories of garbage is been added that is e waste and it comes under the category i after 2018 another regulations is garbage record book is divided into garbage record book 1 and garbage record book 2 after 2018 Garbage record book 1 contains the category a to i and garbage record book and it contains the category j and k grb1 contains the category a plastic waste b food waste c domestic waste d cooking oil e incinerator s f operational waste g animal carcasses h fishing gears i e waste p2 contains the cargo residues waste j is for non harmful to marine environment and k is for harmful to marine environment Annex 6 is the regulation for the prevention of air pollution from ships. First is use of hydrochlorofluorocarbon on board ship is banned for new ships after 1st January 2020 because this HCFC causes ozone depletion so these gases are been banned. Second is the new ships built on and after 1st January 2021 and operating in baltic sea ica area and north sea ica area has to comply with tier 3 nox standard the third is the sulfur content in the marine fuels sulfur content in the marine fuels used on board ship should not be more than 0.5% mass by mass after 1st january 2020 fourth is Sulfur contained in bunker should be mentioned in the BDN after 1st January 2020. Now that is fifth EEXI that is Energy Efficiency Existing Ships Index and CII that is Carbon Intensity Indicator was adopted in 2021 and will be enforced by 2023 for the existing ships. and the last is data collection systems in seemp that is ships energy efficiency management plan in this the fuel consumed throughout the year is been calculated and this data is been sent to the flag state and flag state send this data to the imo is a uh, imo can keep record of emission of of carbon from ships Here we have completed the latest amendments. Thank you. Hope this video would help you 
in your examination. Please like, subscribe, share this video with your friends and family. Thank you.